Hey guys, it's Adam here, your Northern Tech, and today we're going to do an unboxing video. An unboxing video of what? Well, you saw that I hooked up my computer over to the uh, TV there, but I got nothing to control it with. So, I found a wicked deal. Unfortunately, the deal's over. I do apologize. But this deal is for a wireless keyboard touchpad combo. This is not the Logitech one. Logitech makes one like this. This one here is by a company called Next Tech, which is the source's in-house brand. So without further ado, let's crack into this thing and see what it's all about. Alrighty people, I've already opened this at the store actually because I wanted to check the action on the keyboard. I know how good the Logitech ones are. Logitech ones are $49, this one was $19. So I kind of was like, eh, there's got to be a reason why it's $19, right? Well, after using it for a little bit and playing with it at the store, I realized the reason why it's $19 not $49 is because it says Next Tech and not Logitech. So let's go ahead and crack into this and we'll see what we get. Actually, I'll first tell you uh, it's compatible with with Windows 8 and Mac OS, no problems there. And um, I think it'll work, no problem. It even comes with the Windows 8 shortcut, oh, freak sakes, it even comes with the Windows 8 shortcut key. And yeah, built in rechargeable battery, which is nice. So you don't have to run around getting batteries, this thing will recharge. And um, it's got all the media keys and the integrated touchpad. Well, let's take a look at it. If I can get it open. Oh, I had it upside down. Oh no, I'm just being stupid. Okay, so once we crack into it here, we have our keyboard, which is, you know, it's a good feeling keyboard. It's not aluminum, it is plastic. But as you can tell on the back, there is nowhere to put batteries because the battery is this whole, I'm having a hell of a time doing this. There we go. The battery is this whole sleeve. This is your battery right here. So you have an on off switch on the back and some legs if you want to sit it on a desktop and kick it up. You can do that right on. Big nice surface area for a touchpad, standard size, and you have all your keyboard layout. No numeric keypad, but not a big deal for what I want to use it for. And you have your two clicker buttons, which actually feel pretty good. The action on the keyboard, it's not too bad. A little noisier than normal, but ah, it'll do the job. Also in the box, you get no CD-ROM because there is no drivers. You get a instruction manual telling you how to hook it up in case you're, you know, you're that stupid and can't figure out how to plug in a micro dongle. That's all it is. One of these things, plug it into the side of your computer, keyboard links up to it, done. And this wire here is your charging cable for when the battery on the keyboard starts to croak. You plug it into this thing and you're off to the races. So that's a bonus right there. So hopefully you enjoyed that unboxing video of the Next Tech keyboard. Does this thing have a model number? Um, um, no it doesn't. This is a, there, there you go. A little bit of, a little bit of reading for ya. How about reading? Gotta love some reading. There you go, some reading. So hopefully you enjoyed that unboxing. Any questions, comments, concerns about this keyboard, you know where to leave them, comment section below. And uh, if you enjoyed this unboxing, click that like button. Another quick shot of the keyboard. Yeah, buddy. So until next time, guys. Peace the frig out.